Hello, boys and girls. Welcome to another edition of uh, Masanda Wonderful Vlog. Uh, we're here for the review and uh, the player ratings. Uh, hopefully today we don't waste time. Uh, we keep it the way Sundowns kept it. Uh, nice, decent. <laughs> nice and yeah. clean. Yeah, like just a little slip. Like, <laughs> <laughs> today's game was just um... like... Today's game was a, was was like a smack nyan. I like yeah, man, bush to Charles Mutlo, and we kept the three points. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, it, it 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 feels good to like supporting that team right now. It 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 it, it really feels good. Ten wins in a row in all competitions. Um, last week, not yeah, week the the, the game before the last one. Uh, we spoke about a winning, a winning momentum, going like win after win after win, and it, it ends up being a snowball, and and we are there ten, ten in a row now, ten in a row. Let's aim for fifteen, twenty, thirty. Never know where this one <laughs> might take us. <laughs> yeah, it, it it really feels good now, and um, I just hope we don't jinx it because like I'm like I it, it doesn't look like we'll lose a game anytime soon because. Um, our defense is stronger. Onyango is stronger. Uh, our, mid- is strong. our midfield is strong. We are scoring goals from anywhere you can think of. Uh, we sc- we are, we, you have Bomudiba who are playing 10, 8 uh, odd minutes here. Yeah. And there you have your Domingos playing, Kapinga coming in, scoring. It just feels good to be doing it like this when you are rotating the squad a bit and you are giving other players a chance and they also contribute. Um, it, it feels good to win like this. And we're not only relying to, uh, on a starting 11 and probably like two impact players or one impact player. The, like last season, like we were carried by Kileto of the bench and we were carried by our starting 11. Never true, true, mm. and 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 it feels like is it me or it feels like something is just brewing. Come on, said like like you said, you don't want to jinx it, but it, it 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 just feels like something something is brewing. But like we 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 know we are that team and we're performing at a level where even the opposition know what it, what's on. Honestly, like like let's look to the next game. Yeah, we'll try to get some dogs, but we we know that superior. Like last year when we won the treble, at no point did I feel like we are superior. At, 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 like, yes, look, it sounds crazy, Rory. Treble winners didn't feel like they're superior, but at no point did I feel like we're gonna win the treble. This isn't I. It, it's it's different. At no point did I um, am I fearing or did I fear what we're gonna lose to Tsipras to Zambia uh, today. Mm. But last year, if you asked me, I could have said mm, it's a 50-50 game. <laughs> um, we'll see how it goes, but at no point, even even at nil nil, even at one nil in the seventieth minute, at no point did I feel like we are about to bottle, bottle this because we are so so much stronger physically, mentally, and everything else. You know uh, what you're saying uh, makes me think of what I was thinking today, Gary. You know, uh, on Sunday we are playing our 18th game of the league, and I just, I'm so anxious for us to get to game 20 or like 21. I want us to be left with like nine or eight games. I, I I swear to you, like I'm already thinking of going unbeaten in the league. Like I'm thinking of a perfect season in the league, and uh, I'll think that after game game week twenty four, I, I I can't think about that. <laughs> I'm, I'm, if 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 I start thinking about that, I won't sleep. I, I promise you, I won't sleep. I'll, it's all. <laughs> when I'm not here, so I'll think about that after game twenty twenty three twenty four. Not 21, like with nine games left, I feel like, uh, I don't know. We are, but the thing is, I know for players, I think it kind of makes them anxious. And after you, they, after you lose, you sort of like get your energy back and you no longer have the monkey on your back. You are playing to be, yeah, you are playing to be uh, 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 undefeated the whole season, unbeatable the whole season. But now I'm already thinking about it. So... Uh, what you just said now, like when I was looking at Mazembe, I'm like, you know, these guys, it's so sad to see them playing vital games, Kasingala, Trezompudu. I'm like, 
These were your guys, the guys who were shining in 2015, and you guys still want to bring those guys. Only one. You know what I mean? And you just sold uh, um, Jackson Mulega for peanuts uh, in to France, and you didn't even negotiate to pay, maybe like have him on loan in January when you saw things and. Uh, Okay, I haven't been following like his progress or what what Lala go France or what, but apparently he's been a player of I, I, I don't know off the bench. Exactly. Much, so, like, so in January you couldn't say who no man like we have a Champions League uh, campaign here. Maybe let's bring Jackson Muleka and hopefully he can carry us Nyala. <sighs> what a nothing team! You can't say these guys yeah, are a billionaire the way they are moving like they. They failed to refresh the squad um, that carried them for the past five years, and I think that's where you can see the difference between us and them. But it's so crazy that in the league, like the top of the league, they they have a similar and identical record to uh, Liarona in 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 their domestic league, and you would say their domestic league is more competitive because there are like four or five teams, uh, points difference like three or five points. You, mm-hmm. you, but on the continent, um, the, the the gap is is and they yeah, and, but and the last season they, and the last season they had a good campaign because Jackson Muleka was the top scorer. Like I think they, he, they, he got knocked out the, the, they got knocked out on the quarters. Keraja, I think. I think. Uh, I think I remember. Uh, they had a they had a good campaign, Mara. Like to see them not bolster their squad, like. How are you guys? How are you guys still playing at these guys? I mean, like, imagine if we had came to this game, ka sugar le shampo in midfield. Okay, yeah. Uh, when you put it like that, <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. But you know, when I do, I don't want to lie to you. I feel like we are gonna, we are gonna finish this. Um, Group stages like on on uh, oh, uh, on a hundred percent record. I guess in Al Hilal away doesn't really scare me. I think it the, doesn't. The worst we can do there is a draw. The draw definitely. I I I don't see us losing go into Dan. So even if we lose the next two, like we are top of the league, top of the league. Yeah, we are top of the league, but we are through to the quarterfinals and top of the group. So mm. so yeah, I'm 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 sure the coaches will give um. Players who haven't played, I don't know, who haven't played enough um, game time Kusudan for the experience, for Kapinga, for the experience with Alawi in the Champions League game. Because, you know. Yeah. Even though I would like us to win all our games, um, I wouldn't mind the draw uh, in Sudan. But, and but you know, like we can have a brain fart and concede two goals for first half. Mm. Yeah. So. But, but, but can, can the Sundowns? Have that brain fight in court too. I, I I I don't see it, boy. I don't see it. I've seen I've seen teams in in the in a hot streak have a brain fight and lose a game. Like some some things you 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 look. Really, did you see? Okay, they're not on a hot streak, but like, did you see Benley beating Everton at home? Things no. like that. Yeah, it's a boy. <laughs> they happen, <laughs> but like, I would be happy with a draw. Uh, I would be happy with three points, but I would take a draw, go Sudan, and then come here and brush aside the team from from Algeria. Algeria, mm. yeah, yeah, yeah. But on, but on. even but even if we can play a draw here at home, Mara, Restadile ka fifty percent French players, I would I would take that. You take that, yeah. Yeah, Restadile ka bogos. They rook must must play. They rook must play football. They must play football. They rook and shall we must run them to the ground. Mm-hmm. They must mm-hmm. be like. They must be like. <laughs> they must be like Rivaldo 2019. Rivaldo 2019. Mm-hmm. You couldn't take it. You <laughs> play, play every minute of every game. Yeah, yeah. It must yeah. be like that. But yeah, going to the to today's game. Um, it was. It was. You know, like. You know when you know you're going to clinch a business deal and you don't have to put on your lucky tie or your lucky shirt like it's, it's just a, 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 a killing boy like it was just another day at the office it was a routine day yeah. routine day at the office true 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 um we we started in the first 
10 15 minutes we never go back age we wanted to suss them out like if they are they are here for a win and they'll throw everything at us or level or not they'll be after the result they go to done uh those two teams they'll be maybe cautious but they get a draw so we didn't like we didn't and this intensity right now in the first 15 minutes wasn't as 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 good as we know it, it, it can be and it has been in the past couple, in the past month or so yeah so started a bit okay and then you know something just 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 the pin just drops cuz and down so some Temba will do something or or, or Gaston will do something and then we start play we started knocking it around Mushish and Gaston and Blesa started uh, started doing their thing Levo started uh, counter pressing arena when they home so from from the 20th minute going forward we, we were utterly dominant utterly dominant like, I, you tweeted kafka time said 70% position yeah that's in the champions league <laughs> <laughs> that's unheard of but yeah. as much as much as we were dominant we were not threatening like we didn't show the, the, the... I, I was about to say we, we were dominant on the ball but we didn't we were not penetrating them enough up until that moment of quality from Gaston to Mshishi Mshishi to level back of the all on back that that moment of quality decided the game but we are right we're not penetrating enough yeah i think we were just teasing them uh, it, it it was a it was a killing marek we were sunning them man like you know like yeah. when we're playing to prove to you who like we are better we are better than you that's what we were doing. Yeah, yeah. That's what we did. Even that goal. Uh, that goal was a training ground goal. Like it, 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 that move, man. Ah, uh, woman. That move can be uh, just telepathy, in jail. Like <laughs> but, 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 if 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 it had happened, ka other players, I'd say, I'd, I'd agree with you. I disagree with you because it happened, ka those two players, ka, Gaston Tumshishi, Gaston Tumshishi, <laughs> Mushishi in the Champions League and then Mushishi in the Champions League is, is Mushishi in the Champions League. Yeah, Golu Ela in, in basketball, uh, there's a move we call a three-man wave where you just pass the ball while weaving across the court and then whoever catches the ball in the paint is the one who finishes and that's what it looked to me. That's why I get it, man. Hey, man, that move looked too routine for my liking. <laughs> And Lebo's finish, uh, and Lebo's finish was so good. Uh, the technique he used to to hit that, like, because usually, and uh, you know, I think that's one of our biggest Achilles sometimes. Usually, Lebo looks for tape and locker pass. Yes, 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 true, true. You're 100% spot on. You're so, I think, spot on. I, I think one of the things that make you see, that make you feel like, hey, will this team stop here, is that, the things that we always complain about are the things that you see improving, like us taking shots um, that we don't really usually take. Like Lee shot the leg, Gaston, the, the, the goalkeeper saved guy in the first half. Like, okay, I know Gaston takes those ones, but sometimes there we look for a pass. Sometimes, sometimes Renagadi, the the Renagadi, the goal is yeah, Renagadi, the perfect goal, the tap in, and then sometimes. You don't need that. But one thing I like is that um, to have one of your aides uh, contributing to goals is what makes this team special because Trump yep. always had a goal in him. Uh, mm-hmm. That 2015-16 season, Zungu had goals in him in that Telcom run, that Telcom knockout run. Zungu was scoring, was scoring goals. And Trump was scoring goals. Even in the final, he scored a goal. And Lyle is scoring goals. Uh, Tapelo has an odd goal. And then our front three, they score goals. So, in in another game, I forgot who we were playing. I think Al Hilal, Libusa got a goal. And I, I think those are those are things that when you look at you like this this team, uh, we're getting goals from everywhere. Like I don't want to lie to you. I don't want to lie to you. You know, the only thing that's stopping this team to to start conversation. In terms of comparison of the 2016 team, is that the 2016 team did this? Mm-hmm. If this team mm-hmm. can I add another one, yeah. Yeah. Was, we are having we are we are having conversations now because yeah. Yeah. to me, 
we are playing the thing is that that team was ruthless the 2015-16 team was so ruthless they're not all bad like for real but i honestly feel like this one we have a better squad we have a way better squad yeah squad definitely yeah definitely we have a definitely better squad so a better squad yeah so right now Mamelodi Sundowns is competing with itself um and i think that's the one thing that i like we are competing with ourselves so yeah going back to the game we digress so much going back to the game i think first half i was happy with the performance but second half <clears throat> i wasn't that happy and the funny part is that we created chances but we just didn't surely late today was had an off day off 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 day but mm-hmm. if you're going to give me a, a late winner uh, in the western cape uh, i'll allow you to have an off day um, an off night on a tuesday yeah i'll allow you to have an, an off an off night on a on a tuesday evening kickoff uh, but hey, we should have scored we didn't take care of the ball the second half even though we no. had ma- good moments where we played out the press and like we were super press resistant but those that is the only highlight the second half second half is we continue to dominate and we played with out fear like we played out the press we we found ways to to get into to get to the final third but we were not doing the right things in the final third there was a move that Shalulile should have passed the ball to Gaston and you know Gaston is going to find you back mm, but exactly. he, tried, he tried to be clever or he tried not to be too obvious and it didn't work out i think you passed to Gaston there Gaston not really is a player and i think that's what even made Gaston when he get when he got the ball after that move Lena when he took that shot because you know man uh, these guys also want their individual uh, they want to be on the stage sheet as well but I think if we could we could have taken better care of the ball in the second half and we could have been more ruthless. I mean, Shalulile should have easily easily scored a brace in the second half easily. I don't want to lie to you. Yeah, I wasn't happy with um us keeping the ball. We 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 looked casual. We gave away the ball too easily and it was at a time where Mazembe threw the kitchen sink at us. like uh, the f- first 20 minutes ka second half Mazembe threw everything. They threw, mm-hmm. they threw everything, but at no point did we feel like more consider more because of how good our center back pairing was. We'll get to that later, but yeah. because of how good our center back pairing was, we didn't feel like look more consider. But Masembe threw everything like like Nevada boy. They were committing at 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 at, at one point they were committing five six men copy their full for their full backs were were were, were aggressive and and we. We survived that that um, wave of pressure. The only thing that uh, I wasn't happy about was us giving the ball. We could have easily punished them on the counter attack, like you said earlier on off off camera. Then we feel like we made the wrong subs because the game was screaming out Gelito, like you said, like one ball over the top for Gelito and Peter Shalouli. We were right in behind them because they had like they had committed. Like I said, at one point six men forward, and they really wanted to go. So us giving away the ball, not taking care of the ball, uh, uh, better uh, uh, care of the ball. <laughs> it really like, momentum. Like we couldn't get forward, Kapila, because Lebo, Mukulisi, Temba, even Riva surprisingly gave away the ball too much. That's a mm. Mm. You know what I would have done, especially around the 65th minute. I would have actually put on um, Aubrey. Uh, for Lyle, I would have put on Kelezo for for Gaston. Uh, Aubrey for Lyle, of, of course. Aubrey has his tail up, not like like Shaluli or or, or or any of our informed players, but like you just came from a, a moral boosting game. Even though you played for like ten or five minutes against Stellenbosch, I think his his confidence is up there. But I also understand the substitution by Zengaya for you now. From Shishi because Aubrey is very good at retaining the ball. Even though I'm, I'm saying this, even though I saw him lose two balls, but Aubrey at any time his his ball retention is very good. Um, not like Villa level, but something close to that. But I think I would have put Aubrey because of his pace and his delivery, and uh, him also his final third decision making is so good. Um, I think I would have put him there. I would have put Kelezo in. 
And uh, I like that they kept Mkulisi. And if you have AJ and you have Mkulisi and you still have Mabowe or you have Hashim Domingo and you have Obri there, you have Kelezo, you still have Sharulil. I'm telling you, you we're going to get something, especially with the way uh, Mazembe was so aggressive. I think we would have definitely, we would have definitely gotten a, a goal or two. And I think one goal was going to deflate them so bad, we would have even scored one or two more. Third. Yeah. Yeah. So, but yeah. you said that, said that. Yeah, happy. Yeah, routine. Happy. Like you said, routine day at the office. Um, we can get to the ratings now. Um, I, I tweeted about Denise. Uh, I actually like the fact that Kajenu, we didn't have commentators and it was so quiet. You could hear every single thing. And yeah. I, I loved, I loved how Denise was commanding and shouting from the first minute to the last minute. There was a ball where, like, we were caught uh, flat, Komrao, and uh, our defenders had to face their own... Uh, they, they had to rush back because Mazembe was attacking us in the first half. And Dennis just screamed, Rushin, Rushin, it's yours! And Rushin, without even looking, like, I think he had a half a glance, and then he saw where the ball was, and then he cleared it and then he said, Good, my boy, good, my boy. And, like, you know, like things like that, <laughs> you, know, you know, the thing is, because Dennis is such a clown, uh, you can tell her, even in the field of play, he's a clown. It reminds me of, uh, I think I told you this the story uh, I got told, Sati Gumudi is like when Tigo was still playing and Surprise was still there, apparently Tigo like, would uh, demoralize the opponent so bad. That when they pass to surprise, it'd be like, ah, oh, I get gold. <laughs> like, apparently, like, Nakuza surprise, come gaming, and like, he would scream and laugh. Like, a surprise would hit, like, a touch that kills a defender so bad. And apparently, Tigo would laugh, a high pitched voice, and a high. And it would be annoying to the opponents, but like, it would mm-hmm. give us the, yeah. So, you know, that uh, playfulness. Uh, apparently, with him, Connor Zikotags, like, he was a clown. <laughs> yeah. uh, so, Going back to Denis Onyango, like I, I loved how we could hear him today, and he was commanding. He was commanding. Like you would hear him say, "Play to Tabelo, play to Tabelo." And I, was, I think he also has like a good view. Also, his height helps. Like he has a good view of of, of the page. Like play to Tabelo, play to Tabelo, Tabelo, open up, mang mang. Like, and at one point you heard him, Lee Rulan is screaming at at at, at Blesser. Like he was saying, "Pito, Pito." You could even hear Andy Lehatena. So. I, I love that. I love that from from Denise. Like he's been very commanding. And we said Huri, since we signed um, Ricardo Goss, his distribution has improved. Did you see oh. when we were inviting the press and he was, was pinging the I ball? Was to, <laughs> I was about to say like 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 since when he, Denise Atala his distribution like would start the ball, pass it to Musa, pass it to 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 Rushin, back to Denise. They would come. And depending again, okay, um, then it's like, whether well, I was standing happy, <laughs> they just dig it into midfield, into the full backs, back to the, like, 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 his, his, none of that, none of that, I, I would actually him. love to see, I'd actually love to see his, um, passing accuracy, like, I, I, yeah. I, I don't remember seeing him misplace a ball, um, he'd always find Lyle, Tapelo, Blesa, um, Riva, Le, Lelevo, so, I think Denis was so good today. I'm torn between him, the Rook, and Mawoe is my man of the match somewhere there. Yeah, yeah, you're not far. You're not far. Yeah, yeah. Between the far. three, between the three, um, and Denis had some good saves. Like especially even in the second half, there was a time where, hey man, there was this other one. Like and then that that guy hit it so well. Mara Denis like saved it like like it's nothing. Um, uh, there are days where you like he didn't have much to do, but today you could see he had some something to do. Yeah. Like, he worked, and mm-hmm. I'm giving him an eight for his distribution. Yeah, for his distribution. <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, Tabel was so good today. He was he was so good. Today. There was one bad move where he made he could have. Played in a couple of it was Shaduli in the first half and and Mangova, Kush Mangova got all the blames and he wasn't happy with him. Yeah. After that move, like he was he was peerless. 
he was giving us width. He was taking on La Stressa, the, the other fullback, yeah, the, yeah, the opposition. He could he could take care of his men one on one, and you know what type of space he can do that. Mm. So so I was so happy with him. Got performance here high, seven. Yeah, uh, I agree with you. Um, I'm giving Rushin an eight. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I'm not gonna say much. Ooh. Even though he paid his, he paid school fees today uh, in the second half. There was time. There were there were two instances where like he lost concentration, and mm-hmm. you can see that he's still that. yeah he's still learning the, the the Sundowns way of playing. Um, but other than the two uh, slip ups, uh, he was good commanding. Uh, just to add, because um, I'm going to give Musa Lubusa the same rating. Okay. Just to to add, um, guys, center back pairing, guys, the specific center back pairing is. Is they could play, we could play so further higher up the pitch. The counter press header now could be so higher up the pitch because of these two have pace to cover speed. That's why Liverpool was so good. Gabriel Van Dijk, Lee, Lee, Lee Gomez, because they could defend, they could they could defend one on one because they they are big, but they are, they, they they are so pacey. So it's very difficult for the opponents to run in behind them. So this particular centre back play makes us play a bit higher up the pitch because they can defend 40 yards uh, they, anything that goes in the air they can hear it anything that goes in behind them they have the pace to cover for that so i was i was i was excited to see that because of they can defend one on one uh one v one and two v two they can like we could we could leave these two striker summers and go pay with those, with those two and not have a third person in case the odd pace are no 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 mm. that was two versus two one versus one which, which, I, which I thought was brilliant yeah I think I think it's our best centre back pairing I, I, I I'm saying this I'm saying this without we this all know meant- we all know what Nascimento gives us like I don't mm-hmm. it's probably been three seasons so don't this thing about Nascimento mm-hmm. but <laughs> I th- I think this is our future center big pairing, and I think this is our best center big pairing. For me, it's a tremendous event. No, no, no way. Why you did that? Uh, like this is a center big pairing for the next five years. He knows. He knows. Yeah. He knows. Um. Yeah. I think I think Lyle was off it today. Yeah, he wasn't on it today. No, no was he it. was. He was off it he today. Um, 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 and even against Stellan Bosch. But the thing is, like uh, last week Saturday when we played that other Saturday when we played Masambe, like he was he was on the money. Uh, but for, mm-hmm. the, for the past two games, he was off it. Kajeno Honaibile had a very quiet game. Uh, and you know, sometimes when you're playing for Sundowns, it can be it can it can be a bit tricky because. People will see you on the ball for 90 minutes. Like they will see you like going up and down. But at Sundowns, most of the time, it's about like the the quality because um, Lyle has given us very good performances. Uh, and uh, unfortunately, at Sundowns, the bar well, the, the, the the higher you set the bar, the more we are not receptive to anything below. If you come back and the bar is three. Pass below, Ritura out. What's happening now? Because we, we saw you take it there, but Ooh. I think I think Lyle today was off it. Um, four. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, I'm not sure about the reverse performance, Kajun. Um, he gave it away. First half did what he does. Peerless. Second half he gave away the ball. <laughs> Second half, gave away the ball a bit too much for my liking. Like we could have. I, normally, we keep the ball Kariba. Like ball retention here in arena was is, is very good because of Kariba. So mm. well, today, not so good. A five. Mm, yeah, I'll take it because I'm not that sure. Um, mm. Is it Dennis Rashin and Mabue? Like somewhere for me, there's a there's a there's, there's a man of the match. Okay. My boy, I'm also giving him an eight. Uh, he was so good. Uh, oh, and he scored. <laughs> I forgot that part. I forgot that part. He also scored. Uh, I liked how he covered for Tabelo Gajin. 
Yes, he did. He did. He covered, he covered he for did. Capello, and the pressing we saw him, I like initiate like a uh, couple of city. We saw it today, and a uh, couple of you can say, ah, it's an NFD team. It's a bit easier. Oh, one, two. But to do but, it back to back against Puma that's different yeah. gravy. That's different gravy. Uh, he was so good today. Uh, and for as long as he was on the pitch, he was he was the best, best midfielder on the pitch today. Uh, he commanded that midfield and he, he did everything right. And I was happy with um, him contributing to the goals because, you know, modern midfielders have to get a goal uh, here and there. Oh. And actually, I think I'm going to upgrade him to an 8.5. Because I'd forgotten his spot. He's so, so he's your man of the match. Uh, yeah, clearly. Okay, okay. No, yeah. take that. Um, could yeah. see. Mkulisi's performance was like Sundowns' performance today. Uh, business as usual. Like, like, yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay. it was okay. Nothing spectacular. Okay. Okay, nothing spectacular. Just, just workman like business. Business like um, mm. got. Uh, Dropped his six point five and walked off the pitch. Easy, easy. Uh, same as Temba. Uh, especially Temba's performance dropped in the second half. I think. Yes, uh, yes. I, I think he tired a bit. Yeah, I think it like after after playing Kavanaugh on 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 Saturday. That was like forty eight hours ago, seventy two hours ago. And giving you all until the ninety fifth minute, and having to go again on, on a Tuesday after playing on a Saturday. In the second half, he tired a bit. He tired a bit, and his performance uh, dropped. But there was a period between the twentieth minute and half time where Enali, Lee Blesa, and Gaston did their thing, and that's when we we stamped our authority on the game, and which was dictating. As mm. as I know in, in the Champions League, so yeah. you're right. He's performing well in the second half. Yeah, but in the first half, it was so good. I'm not sure if he would have recovered. Marge Tuesday, I think he would have recovered on Sunday. Marnegiri, I would rest him on Sunday. Oof. Mm, let's go yeah. again. Let's go. It's, it's before international break. Let's go. Let's go again with our strongest team. And you know they're gonna they're gonna run him down. Can international can can do it. Yeah. <laughs> You know, actually, and, and, actually, it's okay, but you won't rest him in the Champions League game. But and, ideally, and, you would have loved, you would have rested him today, with the Lille Saturday, and play on Sunday. Ideally, you would and, rest him today. We can rest him. And Neil just reminded me that Peter Shalul is not there on Sunday, so we can rest him. She will need, we will need every goal scorer we have in the team. What, what what's the update on uh, Kim Terasmus's injury? What are they saying? No, no, no. I know he's not available, but what are they saying? What's the diagnosis? They're not saying anything. We don't even know who the category, man. I saw someone tweeted, um, I think it was Propila, and he said he's in a moon boot. So, oh yeah, uh, the final say will be on Wednesday, whether he's out for a couple of weeks or for months. So, we'll see. I know, it's. I'll find out tonight. No way. Like, um, Cambridge should be there. But, uh, yeah, that injury that, that yeah. doesn't look good. Uh, and not having Shaluli, like, having yeah. having Cambridge would have would have been nice on Sunday. Yeah. 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 Oh, so now, like, oh, it's yes. I'm sure she can't rest. You can't even say... So you can't even say... Oh, who? I'm I forgot. Um... Got an assist. Mishi is always a goal, goal, goal contributor uh, in the Champions League. Contributor. <laughs> and then I got Lala. Uh, I think six point five. <laughs> All right, yeah, six point five. Um, shall we leave mm, five? Yeah. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Gaston Gaston I don't know whether it's a 4.5 or a 5 4.5 4.5 ne? It just feels harsh Shem. That when Shalulil yeah. is it, it, it feels harsh but... Yeah it feels harsh Shalulil yeah. 
is a five when he's off with Gaston is a four point five. But I think, yeah, um, AJ, he was good. He was good when he, he was our first sub. Gave away the ball. He was our first sub. Yes. Yes, he was. Yeah. Doesn't he give away the ball on a couple of occasions? Well, well, everyone gave away the ball, so I can't. I wouldn't. I wouldn't. I wouldn't like penalize him too much because of that because everyone was giving away the ball. But he was good. Like he slotted in like the river. Usually, river was an eye and nothing changed. And but yeah. instead, the higher the standard was raised a bit higher. He was dictating so, yeah. play and yeah, no, like uh, he was vocal and uh, he did the right things. AJ is uh, AJ is a uh, if uh, took the words out of my mouth. Um, uh, 5.5. Okay. And then Aubrey? Mm. Okay, I agree. I agree. Uh, Hashim Domingo. Oh, Hashim Domingo, yes. Rating? 4.5. I think he was was, was a bit better. A bit better than 4.5? Yeah, I think he was a bit better than, than Aubrey. But uh, yeah, you can actually give him a four point five. Afonso, yeah. Afonso looked okay on the ball. He looked he looked a bit. You know, Touches are high where he played a combination play with with the midfielders looked good a bit. So yeah. um, hopefully, I don't know. Probably he's going to start on Sunday. Probably uh. he's going to start on Sunday. Mm-mm. So what's my mom? What next day? As much as we said. Give us a little bit of a breeze, guys. That was same. Hopefully, uh, yeah. Afonso. Same, I'd say same. Same as uh, Obri and Hashim. Yeah, four point five. Yeah. Uh, who else came on? No one else, ne? Ah, that's it. Yeah, that's it. Uh, coaches. Because of the sub situation, we we. We spoke about in the beginning of of, of the semester review. I, I can't give him a ten, so I'll give him um, an eight. Yes, I agree with your eight. I was gonna give them an eight as well. I think they, they, their subs were were off. Hanya, the, yeah. their subs were off. Yeah, uh, yeah, that's it. Nothing else. Uh, yeah. We'll see you. We'll see you after. Ah man, imagine like a fly out of nowhere. Okay. Hey boy, good luck about to see. Yeah, um, see yeah. See you on Sunday after a big, uh, a, another big three points. We're playing home. Come on, there's no way we can take the three points there. And yeah, let's continue. Let's continue doing this thing, guys. Uh, we'll see you then. Uh, this fly is actually telling me that it's time. So yeah, time to pick up. Yeah, it's time to pick up. See you on Sunday. Thank you for watching. Uh, uh, please comment, uh, share. We appreciate your comments. Uh, Share the video, like, and uh, subscribe if you haven't. If you oh, have. thank no, you. No, 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 no. <laughs> Are you? I can't say it. Yet. But I think you commented well under his, his comment on, on YouTube, which was funny. Thanks for watching, whoever you are. Oh, the one I commented on. Yes. Oh, yeah, yeah, I saw it. I saw it. <laughs> continue, continue commenting. Uh, we appreciate any type of feedback. We appreciate. Definitely. Yeah. Bye bye guys, uh see you uh after the break lepers game. Cheers.